Scenes from the Guide, a Ukrainian film submitted for an Academy Award a few years ago. It tells the story, uh, or it takes place during the 1930s when it was the first time Russia was subjugating Ukraine, and that time they were doing it with a famine. Um, now they're doing it with bombs and bullets. Howard Kiddash runs the Digital Cinema Distribution Coalition, and he got an idea. I've never seen anything happen like this in this industry before, to be honest. In just a few days, his company organized a mammoth fundraiser, distributing this film by satellite to 608 theaters around the country, including three here in central Alabama. Nine-year-old American Anton Green, with deep Ukrainian roots, starred in the film 10 years ago. Everyone from my mom's side of the family lives there. Um, my mom actually came to the United States soon after the Soviet Union collapsed. His grandmother remained in Ukraine. She came here for on a vacation like around three months ago, and she was her plane was scheduled to go back right when the war started, like a few days after it started. So she's been staying here with us the entire time. And two little cousins managed to get on a plane by themselves. And now they're living here with us as well. Uh, for safety, you know, because nowhere in Ukraine right now is it really safe. Now studying political science at Michigan, Anton doesn't act anymore, but still speaks with love and defiance in two languages. Slava Ukraina, i Ukraina peremoja. Glory to Ukraine. And then I said that Ukraine will win. The thriller known as The Guide will be showing all this coming week at three theaters in central Alabama right here at The Edge in Birmingham, The Regal in Trustville, and The Amstar in Alabaster, with 100% of the proceeds going to the International Red Cross and other charities benefiting Ukraine. In Birmingham, Jeff Eliasoff, WVTM 13.